Hello everyone and welcome to Wolf Quest 2.7 and we are here on Amethyst Mountain with Atlas actually because I have decided we need to refind Atlas's mate Storm. As many of you guys know you cannot carry your mate from Lost River over to the creek level where you can actually have puppies with her. So I thought it would be really fun to say that Atlas in his usual silly way managed to get lost oh, separated from his mate Storm and he is searching for her here on Amethyst Mountain. So in Instead of just like finding the very first mate that we can, like we usually do with all of our previous wolves, we are going to continue to hunt and search across Amethyst Mountain with Atlas until he can find a dispersal female who looks just like Storm, and we're going to say that that is Storm. And I actually was going to do that on my own for a little bit, but Atlas is already getting into quite a few adventures since we have been here. Oh, it's a coyote! A coyote! Are you going to play with him, Atlas? Unfortunately for the coyote, that never spells like a happy day. Oh my, there we go. But yeah, Alice has been getting into a lot, of, a lot of adventures here while I've been just trying to find where his mate could have gone off. Is this another dispersal female? It's another dispersal female and she looks really cool, but she is the wrong colors for Storm. Storm needs to be more of an all white wolf. So we'll come up here and Alice is just like, oh, you're not Storm. And she'll be like, oh, and he'll be like, I'll be going now. And I'll just leave that dispersal female here. And so we'll continue to try to find somebody. But see, we've been doing that. So anytime we run into a dispersal female who does not look like Storm, we've just been leaving. And Atlas actually unlocked a new achievement called Charmless. Get rejected by a potential mate because of not being able to uh, take that mate or that wolf as his mate. So that was kind of interesting. He's been doing that and he also took on some more bears. He ran into some bears that he managed to get in a fight with. So there was just a lot going on and I was like, you know what, maybe we will share Atlas's goofy, silly journey with you guys once again because, you know, we just don't know what he might get up into. Plus, maybe we'll find some more of the achievement things we need. So we just left that wolf area and we are returning into it and we are going to hunt around for new wolf territory markers to see if we can find another dispersal female. I've run into three or four of them so far in this area and two of the males that belong to the pack here. Oh, here's another, like, this is one of the females that belongs to this area. So I think we actually have to defeat her in order to get her to go away so that new wolves will show up, unfortunately. So we'll just say Alice decided, um, maybe he, like, accidentally angered her. We're going to pretend like she, she fought first. But we want to get in the first blow. She's really tough, actually. You're not my mate. Go away. And I like seeing that storms are coming back because it makes me think like, Storm will find you yet. Oh my gosh, she is really tough. All right, that's better. That's better. Leave now. Alice is searching for his mate. All right, maybe he's a little bit irritated. Not his usual good-natured self because we are trying so hard to find where his mate went off to. He wants Storm back. So then we'll just exit the area once again. We're going to come over here to get a little bit of food first. Then we exit the wolf area, turn around, and continue to hunt and see who we run into. But like I said, it's been pretty darn interesting with seeing what else he's run into. The other wolf packs, he ran into a bear. We of course bit the bear promptly in the butt because that is what Atlas does. He is the bear butt biter. I kind of wonder, oh, and somebody came up with the idea that one of Atlas's pups should be named Bear. And I actually really love that idea. <laughs> Because, you know, they're the bear butt biters. Oh, coyote! You want to play? Oh, and there's actually a territory marker nearby. Oh, where is it? Where is it? Where's it going to? Is it going over here? This is... Oh, it's another one of the females. Oh, uh, maybe we should just take a hint this time. Let's just take a hint this time. And if she shows up again, then we know we probably have to chase her off once more. So, we'll do that. And we might just start searching around the other areas. Because this... It just at first I was like, I don't know, just running around Amethyst Mountain. But the more I thought about it, the more I'm like, this is so Atlas that of course he would lose his mate. And of course he would have to go on this big epic journey of finding like where Storm has gone off to and searching for her because he wants his Storm back. All right, and another coyote that we're playing a little bit roughly with. All right, coyote is gone. Searching, so this was the coyote sent right here. And now we are searching for any other wolf scent. 
that we might be able to stumble upon. Sometimes it's hard to find them. We have to exit the territory and come back in. Sometimes we just stumble right on like the wolf. Uh, oh, 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 oh. Here we go. Here we go. Is this? Yes. All right. Territory markers. Territory markers. Two minutes ago. Two minutes ago. Closing in on somebody. Could it be Storm? Are we going to find Storm? No, too dark to be Storm. Dispersal female. But she's too dark to be Storm. She needs to be like a white wolf to be Storm. Pretty sure. Well, hang on a second. Actually, I don't think Storm was all white. This this looks like Storm, doesn't it? It's Storm! Okay, so let's go hello there. We're saying we we found Storm again. I like you. Because, yeah, yeah, Storm did look like this. Because I remember she looked kind of cloudy. And I remember thinking she fit in with the clouds. And if this isn't Storm, then this is just a very confused wolf who is like, Why do you think, um... Why do you think I am who you think I am? Well, this is good because now we can get these two settled in so that they can have their own den. Chasing storms. Uh, let's start a pack. What do you guys think? Oh, goodness. There we go. They should make a happy family. All right, yeah, this is definitely a storm. So we're, we're going to stick to, like, um... Probably weather bear bear has to be if we have a little boy we have to name him bear though for Atlas because that is just so perfect. So probably weather and like kind of naturey things and it's storm yay we've got her again. See we managed to pull that off. That makes me happy. Let's let's maybe go hunting with her pretty soon. We'll go hunting with her over at the creek area actually. So let's go down to the creek. Nice and fast. Looks strong, just like the last storm. Very happy with this. I hope this is like storm. Maybe storm was a little wider, but we're just gonna roll with it and say this is storm. Because <laughs> it's the best we can do. I haven't really run into like a white, white wolf um, since we started looking for dispersal females or any kind of dispersal mates either though. So I don't even know if you can run into a pretty white wolf when you are like looking for a dispersal mate, but you can definitely have a white wolf be one of your your puppies if you have enough experience points. All right, let's go ahead. We're gonna go onto the creek. And we are going to let Atlas and Storm start settling into their den. And I know exactly which den I want them to have. Hello, you two. All right, we're gonna go look for a den. You're not, uh, she's close enough to the same color as Storm. But I'm thinking, and I'm a little nervous about this, which den should these two have? I kind of want them to have this den right over here. Even though this was kind of a bad luck den for us before, because this is where Eclipse's second letter of all girls had been raised before they passed away. It is a very good den. I love its proximity to the hunting grounds. Ooh, elk, 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 let's do some hunting. Let's do some hunting. All right, there we go. Got some hunting. Let's see what it's like to hunt with this new mate. All right, let's chase, not that cow elk. Maybe this cow elk? Yeah, she's nice and weak. So let's chase her down and see if we can hunt her. We wanna chase her away from the river for sure. There we go, that's better. All right. No, don't go back towards the river. Don't go back towards the river. Oh, good job, Storm. Oh my gosh, look at him go. Atlas, go, 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 go. You and Storm have got this. You and Storm have got this. Oh my gosh. They are so strong. I feel like Eclipse never is able to hunt this well. Look at that. These two took that elk down in no time. They're going to be able to have their den in no time at all. This is going to be awesome. This is going to be absolutely fantastic. There's the elk herd kind of scattered about, a little bit alarmed at the, the way things have progressed. But yeah, these two should be fine. They have enough pack stats. Yeah, they have enough pack stats. They should be able to name puppies. And good, good, good. They've hunted quite a few elk. Elk hunts 12. Elk killed 11. Coyotes killed 13. Grizzlies chased off three. Atlas, I feel like you've chased off a lot more than just three grizzlies. I really do. Maybe not, maybe so. 
He encountered six dispersal encounters, but only like stuck with one mate. That's adorable. All right, maybe we'll try hunting one more time. Let's see, any weak cow elk over here? Just to make sure that we know how to do a good team with these two. All right, so we know who's gonna try to run for it over here. I've got you. Go Atlas, go, 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 go. He is really strong. If we can get Storm to come up and bite her from behind. Yes, like this. I don't think she's getting away. I really hope she's not getting away. Oh my goodness, look at these two. They're so good. They're so good at hunting. Yeah, these two should be a good pair. I am very happy about this. I'm very happy that we managed to find Storm. I really thought it was going to take longer than that. Maybe she's not exactly the right colors for being Storm. But we're just going to have to say Storm's winter coat has come in or something like that. All right. And while we're over here, let's see if we can find... Is this the shallow spot? Yeah. Shallow spot where it's safe to cross with puppies. Everything looks so different with all of the plants in their winter dormancy. And then we'll come up... And we will go ahead and maybe hunt around the den a little bit. I want to give all of you a chance to be able to name Alice's and Storm's puppies. I know that for sure we are going to be naming one bear if it's a boy. That's definitely happening. But then like latitude, longitude, there were a lot of like cute um, like geography themed names. But I think we'll definitely go with like weather related names just to go with Storm. Bear will be like Alice's legacy. And... Then we'll stick probably to the weather sort of theme. All right. I wonder if he wants to go sniff those stranger wolves. Let's see. Where is the den? I know where this den is. We've used this den. I think it's like right below us. How do I always manage to get myself so turned around when it's trying to find this den? It's over here. There we go. There's the den. So this is going to be our den right here. It is a good den, if you ask me. It has served the family well in previous generations. So we're going to make this our den. I really like it. It's a good den. Storm might, might enjoy it too. So we've chosen this den. We're going to mark our territory. We won't complete marking our territory right now, though. We'll just kind of get a little bit of a start on it. Because I really want you guys to be able to have a chance to come up with more names for maybe like cloud formations, maybe different types of weather. Let's see, we're gonna come this way. Where on earth do I mark my territory? Over here, down here. But yeah, like different types of weather, cloud cover, um, different names for storms. Rain maybe is such a pretty name. If we have a little girl, maybe we'll name her Rain. Things like that, it's gonna be awesome. But yeah, next time we come back with Atlas, he will be raising his puppies. So we actually have puppies with three different wolves that right now then. We would have puppies with Nightlight because he is raising his Christmas litter of little girls who are almost ready to go and make their way down to the summer hunting grounds with their new, or with their mom Angel. And Atlas's, or excuse me, Eclipse's new mate. Atlas's mate Storm and Atlas, who's wearing the radio collar so we might have the little Easter egg show up are marking their territory over here right now and Eclipse and his mate or not Eclipse see I'm getting them all mixed up because there's so many so I wouldn't be surprised if you guys have to like write it down to keep them all straight but Nightlight and his mate Pandora are working on raising their babies one girl Starlight and three boys and raising them up oh there's a bear to bite the butt of there's a bear to bite the butt of oh did we get hit we got hit yeah. No, go away there. Go away. Why aren't you going away? Why isn't he? What just happened here? <gasps> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay, well, I'm gonna have to leave that in your guys' hands now. Should that be the end of Atlas the Bear Butt Biter? Biting a bear who normally should run away after three bites and he totally didn't. Or should we just say that Atlas, uh, is, the Storm's gonna nurse him back to health? So I'm gonna leave that in your guys' hands, because that was an unexpected twist, um, to the bear butt biting legacy here. And I want to know what you guys think! So, alright! 
Well, I will see you guys next time, and hopefully this will go a little bit better. So, yeah, let me know. Should Atlas continue on his legacy, or with three wolves having puppies right now, should we just focus on Nightlight and his legacy for the Moonpack legacy, and Eclipse and his special Christmas, like, legacy, or should we get Eclipse back up, or Atlas right here back up, and let him have his litter of puppies, because that bear, dang, oh boy. All right, well, I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.